Welcome everybody. Today's video, we're gonna go over Bitcoin as usual, and I'm gonna go over something else, which is the 10 year yield, the debt market. And interesting thing now, a lot of people are in panic, and I understand a lot of people are suffering because they got some money and the um, Celsius. Now it's locked up. They don't know what to do. That's that's understandable. And my, you know, my heart go out go out to those people. And I hope you really get out safe. And things go smoothly. Uh, they was able to put up some more collateral so they can um, avoid a something called like margin call. <clears throat> if they can avoid some liquidation. I hope Bitcoin doesn't go lower. Now, the price is right in the basic fire cell bundle. Now, this this is just a chart. I don't I don't care about charts. Charts are useless. But it's just an indicator, indicator of you know what's going on, like in terms of history from the history. Right? Um, I don't think. Bitcoin cares about the history in the past. Here's the thing. Here's why. This is why I'm gonna talk about the uh, the fact that about the ten year yield, which is like the meltdown of the financial system. And this is not just for me. This is just from this is from an expert in this. Right? He has been studying this for ten years, and he has been waiting for this for ten years. So his name is Gregory Monarino. So now, uh, this, right? So many people didn't doesn't don't understand Bitcoin. They don't understand why it exists, um, why we need it, and they got in. They think it's about getting rich quick. They buy it wrong, and they they store it wrong, and they sell it wrong. Right? This is what they are doing right now, and now like you could see like it's basically fire cell it could go even down go down 50 percent like nobody knows but those those are possibilities but the the point is okay the point is basically we this bitcoin is about changing the world it's about moving us to a different universe bitcoin has its own world it's creating its own world sorry so why because bitcoin basically is imposing its own world upon us and upon this world because the world we're living in is a clown world full of scammers everything is a scam like literally everything is a scam it doesn't matter i don't care what you what you say uh <clears throat> religion like politics and like uh, finances banking everything is a scam school everything is a scam bitcoin is coming in with this this different world right and nobody see i've seen this before right that's why so many people are doing stupid dumb things because they never uh saw this before right they're selling buying they're trading all the stupid things they are doing and you see all those social media influencers right they are coming from the old system right from the corrupt system that's why they get so many people wrecked right because they are incentivized to create crappy content right to get people wrecked right so they can get some advertisement from scammers so they can sell the the viewers soul right that's what they do and this is because of the system the incentives from the old system so bitcoin fixes this because now you know you have a world where if you make a stupid mistake you take your collateral on you over collateralize or you over uh you you know you over leverage you will get wrecked Right? There is consequences. In the current system, there's no consequences. Right? 
You can just do anything you want, right? In fact, if you are the biggest robbery, if you commit the, the, the biggest a big crime, you get rewarded in the current system, right? But in Bitcoin, you make you, you make a stupid mistake. You're gonna pay the consequences for that, and it's 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 not easy. And I, I know, I know it's not easy for a lot of people. I don't, I don't hope, I don't wish that on people. Like, I don't wish that. But it's good for you to educate yourself. Now, this may be a very great occasion for you to learn, understand what this is. I was, I made a lot of mistakes. I lose a lot of money, a lot of money. And you will say, now, if I lose, like, if money can go down, I don't consider that as a loss of money. Because this is basically just... This is Bitcoin is the money. How can I lose money on Bitcoin? That's stupid, right? I, I can't lose money if I buy money. If I sell money, then I lose money, right? So this is from Michael Seller, by the way. I give him credit for that. Now, basically, um, a lot of people think it's about losing money if you have Bitcoin go down. No, you don't understand it yet. You have to understand it first. You don't buy something you don't understand. You shouldn't put anything on it if you don't understand it. Right? That's why I talk about DCA. DCA is really a fundamental understanding of the Bitcoin. Right? Every time you have some money, you, you, you have some money spare cash, you can just throw it in the Bitcoin. Right? And then store it forever and then put it in your own custody. Right? So, 